Hello everyone, this is GrayShot17. Today I'm going to go over a quick fix for Anno 1800. Uh, just for a quick brief history, this game was available for pre-order on Steam to the 16th, and you play on Epic Store before becoming an Epic Store exclusive, part of Ubisoft's deal. That allows Anno to be essentially only sold on the Epic Game Store, while those who bought it on Steam previously can still have it, but on the 16th, it was no longer available on sale on Steam. Now, Steam users have been reporting stuttering and also frame rate drops, incredible amounts of frame rate drops, even on high-end PC cards. Myself, I currently have a GTX 1080, a quad-core i7 processor, 16 gigs of RAM, an SSD, and a couple other little components that should make my PC totally fine to run this game. And during the beta, I was running it around 2K at about very high to high uh, settings. Now, the question is, why is everyone having these issues? Well, I found a solution and let me go step by step of what people are experiencing so I can validate their claims along with also go over the quick fix. All right, so we just entered the menu. On the top right hand side of the screen, you can currently see my frame rate. Along with the middle portion of the screen, you can currently see my active programs. One is my camera, one is Anno and my task manager, again. But we can currently see that with CPU and memory, and remember, I'm recording this both on shadow play and I'm also recording this via my camera, still only 50% of my memory is being used and roughly about a third of my CPU. Now, technically that should be fine. Like I said, I have plenty of PC settings and. Uh, pretty much components that should make this game very easy to run. But if we look in the top right hand corner, right now I'm around 40 frames per second. So that's just in the menu. You can also see the menu, there's a little bit of stuttering going on um, right behind here. I'll show that, yeah, you can see there's a little bit of stuttering with the image. So this is just a brief little thing. Now let's go into continue. Oh boy, it's worse. Yeah, we're about 20, 25 frames per second. And like I said, um, we are currently experiencing massive drops. You can see a lot of just like stuttering it's just moving very slowly there's a lot of issues and even when just zooming in you can tell that there's a just again stutteriness that's going on along with poor performance and again i'm just gonna pull and i'm just gonna pull up my uh, options menu you can really see i wrapped to 2k very high settings overall window full screen again that's just for me i personally like that um, along with all these settings now there are a lot of people currently saying like oh enable v-sync remove that that helps you with frame rate and you're at, and you're right that does the other thing is with DirectX 12. Yes, currently DirectX 12 will cause you to crash on some save games. I found it crashed like once an hour for me. Every time it like would save, it would crash. That being said, that's not causing the frame rate issue. And I'm being 100% honest, that's not causing the stutteringness either, especially for such a high power PC graphics card and CPU. There's something else going on, especially if we once again look at my task manager. And we currently see that even with the game open, it's at 70% memory, 33% of CPU. So there's plenty of additional space for this game to run. So what's going on? So now we're going to get to the part where I'm going to help you fix the game. So this is all we're doing. All you have to do is go to Steam, go offline, restart offline mode. Okay. Once you do that, the um, launch Steam and you're going to be in an offline mode. So essentially even most people would associate that with playing in a single player like variety where you're not connected to the internet so you can't access the store but you're still going to launch anno but what you're going to do is you're going to go into the bottom right hand side of your screen and you're going to go to uplay and you're going to launch anno from uplay now the weird thing is you can't do this before you have to open up the game like it is running poorly close it go offline on steam and then open it through Uplay. If you try to suit, if you try to just keep Steam offline, Steam is especially if you have a Steam copy, that copy won't register with Uplay. So Uplay will not open the game. So we're now going to open up Anno 1800, and we're going to see if there's any difference. Remember, all we did was turn Steam offline, and we didn't even remove it. So it's the same performance, same thing. Nothing else has changed. Okay. So currently we have uh, the game open again and everything is still on. So we have Anno, my camera, Shadow Play is currently recording and also Task Manager. That's the only things currently running app wise as you can see. Now, what's the frame rate? I'm currently getting 60 FPS on this game. Remember my monitor is 60 FPS. I don't have a higher Hertz monitor at 2K. So my apologies on that. If you really, really want to deck this thing out, I won't show you that, but what I will show you is my options menu, and once again, nothing else has changed. Everything is exactly the same as it previously was, but there is a difference. If we go back 
and we go back to my task manager, you can currently see the memory is about 50%, but my CPU has dropped. Remember, it was about a third. Now it's only 18%. So now let's launch the game. Again, I, I want to stress this. I've not changed the settings. Everything is exactly the same because I also don't want to make it seem like I'm currently using a mod or doing some type of thing behind the scenes. The only thing I've done is I've made Steam offline and what has happened? We look at the top right hand corner, I'm getting around 60 FPS. Right now there's no stuttering, everything looks fine. Actually it looks great. As you can see, there's absolutely no stuttering. Movement around the map is seamless and fluid. Again, no real issue. And we currently see the CPU, again, still rather, rather lower and with the memory about the same. So what can I say about this? Most likely, from what I've read on the forums, what is going on is Ubisoft uses a program for anti-cheat or anti-piracy called Denuvo. Currently, they have that running for whatever reason, it is working like twice as hard or doing something weird with Steam. And if Steam is online, it either runs it again or there's a block that causes you to slow down on your own computer. No matter how good your graphics are, no matter how good your components are, it will slow down your game because I believe it's verifying that the game is currently not pirated. And as I say before, the settings on this are not bad. Like again, 2K, everything exactly the same, and it's 60 FPS where I was pulling 20 FPS before. Honestly, yeah, so I'm running 60, totally fine. My camera shadow play are also on, so if you want to take that into a component as well for additional um, issues with the uh causing a frame rate drop absolutely you can absolutely credit that for a couple but not 40 or 50 frames especially because i as i show i currently have my camera on now and i currently have shadow play on on both scenarios so the issue is most likely in my opinion de nuvo i could be very wrong however that's my assumption based on previous history with ubisoft and i do wish that they put out a fix for this but like i said if you're currently having an issue Launch the game, online Steam, online new play, close the game out, go to offline mode on Steam, followed by keeping Uplay online so you can play this game. Now remember, if you are online on Uplay, you can still play multiplayer. And actually, you can download your friends list on Steam to Uplay so you can message your friends and still play multiplayer if you wish. So like I said, Ubisoft does need to patch this and fix it. I hope, hopefully they do in the future, but yes that's my fix for anno i hope this helps you guys out if you are experiencing crashing or other issues with the game a lot of crashing switch to direct x11 and also if you need some extra frames yeah enable v you can disable vsync and that will help but overall if you're having stuttering or massive frame drops then you have to turn off steam launch it on Uplay and you should be fine. That said, you need to launch it first. So now I'm gonna tell you what don't do. Um, for those who are trying to do this fix and may rush it, um, if you launch Steam in offline mode, so I restarted my computer and initiated in offline mode and go directly to Anno 1800. I've done nothing else. I've just launched it in offline mode. That's the only thing I've done at this stage. So if you do that, um, the game is gonna pop up with a notification right here. It's okay, there we go. So it popped up with this saying you need all these points. If you would continue, it's going to say there was a problem authenticating because it didn't send the authentication code originally. So if we go to Uplay and you go to your games, you're going to see in your game section on Uplay that right now this game is not there. Where it was if you started the game on online, then switch it offline and then just launch it off Steam. Uh, sorry, off Uplay. I know this is very annoying and can be frustrating and literally it takes an extra minute to then play this game, but that's the quick fix for it. Um, if you have any comments, I'll gladly answer it regarding how to and I'll also list the setup below, but I want to go in depth because A, I want to show that this is a real problem about Anno 1800 because I don't want to just make a claim and not have proof to show it. So this has been GrayShot17. You can check out uh, hopefully some more Anno coverage in the future with me playing it uh, either on the live stream and or on just mini episodes I'll release next week. And or you can check out my other strategy game content on my channel. But once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Hello, well, before I go, I want to give a special shout out to Patreon supporters Malam, White Hot D, Toussaint, Streaking Wookie, Sergeant McPain, Sebastian, Rifle, Pyroshark, Only Play Apples, Lashu, Just Play Thomas, Junior Chicklist, 
JP Val, Josh, Joey G, Chofo, Chris Bailey, Ace, Tim, Nathan Angus, Leonard Liu, Jordan Savat, and Aaron Yi. Thank you all for your amazing support. You're all incredible. Thank you again, and I'll see you guys next time.